my team turn. Take me out on the water. We eat fishing. Way out in the woods. Where the breathing is easy, the living is good. Out in the grave. And welcome to Leary Smith Outdoors. We're sponsored by the Badger Sportsman Magazine, Bartline Barrels, Warrior Boats, Big Snow Resort, Lynch and McGuanago, Wings Over Wisconsin, Mike's Country Meats, Midwest Shooter Supplies, Burger Smokehouse, Delco, Vexlar, Dick Smith's Bait and Tackle, Come Along Measuring Tools, Commick Law Firm, Norm Zag, and Jiffy. And remember, it's a great day to be alive. Holy moly. Hey boys, guess what? We just, we just made it through the border here. And I'll tell you, we're on our way up to Wilderness North Lodge. And I just got home a day or two before this from Louisiana. So we're going from one extreme to the other, from far south to far north. So it's gonna be an interesting trip this week. We're gonna do a couple different fly-ins and uh, keep things moving. Uh, got everybody up here from the Badger Sportsman Magazine. They're already up here, got things scouted out. So hopefully uh, we catch a pile of fish and have a lot of fun. So stay tuned, let's see what happens this week on Larry Smith Outdoors. On a road trip, a lot of road trips, Lance and Brian, right? Keep her moving. Keep her moving. Oh, a Dairy Queen. They got a Dairy Queen in Canada. Let's stop there. Well, they're not open yet. Lance, why? I want to know why there's all these Chevys here and no Fords. What's the problem? The Fords are further up north, Larry. Why would the Fords be further up north? More snow up there, colder weather. Oh, it's just, you're they saying can the handle it? Oh, I don't know about that. Might be a little exaggeration going we'll on see. there. We'll Maybe. see. Well, Lance has done all the driving. Toyotas are down in Tennessee. <laughs> right. Dodges are in Ohio. Chevys are in Wisconsin. Fords are way up north. Oh, really? Huh. Lance, I think that you're a little delirious from lack of sleep. That could be. <laughs> this guy's a true blue Canadian. Lance, I think this guy's an ambassador. Yeah, it's not warm up here by any means, is it? Fool? Am I the only guy wearing long underwear? Look at you. I got long underwear on. You said we were going to Florida. Uh, yeah. <laughs> not no Florida. I said we're going to Canada. <laughs> You know what? We went down the wrong road, but we did find a couple of bathrooms. If you call them that, well, at least one and a one and a half. Let's check this out. Looks like one's under construction yet. You know the funny thing is, I don't see the work permit. This is this is the one in service. Oh man. Now I know why I stop at quick trips when I go to the bathroom. <laughs> This one definitely needs some T TLZ. Oh, if you could smell that, that's, oh, that's the ventilation. Oh, I don't even want to look down that hole. <laughs> I guess when you gotta go, you gotta go. I better shut the door, I think it's Canadian law. You find an outhouse out in the middle, middle of nowhere. It's been a few years since I've been on a float plane. I want to know if there's enough room on that plane for all that gear that uh, Brian brought. Six tackle boxes. How many rods has he got there? You and I each brought two rods. He's got how many rods? Six for himself. Six for himself, right? You're allowed to use one per person in Canada. Well, how many rods per person? One per person at a time. I wonder why he's got so many rods. One for each day of the week. One for each day of the week? I don't know about that. All right. <laughs>
creating a fishing boat that delivers unsurpassed fishability, speed, and performance on the water is achieved through an ongoing commitment to quality and a driving passion for making great boats even better. You'll see this commitment to quality and a passion for building the fisherman's boat in every Warrior Boat model you see on the water. For additional information on Warrior Boat's new V208, check out their website at warriorboatsinc.com or visit your local Warrior Boats dealer to schedule a test drive and see for yourself why no fishing boat on the market offers a smoother, drier ride, more interior cockpit space, more storage, more room to fish big water in complete comfort and safety than the V208 from Warrior Boats. Dalco, far and away the nation's leading boat cover manufacturer, precisely fit for a large variety of OEM makes and models. Dalco premium covers are the boating equivalent of a hand-tailored suit. Not only are Dalco covers the best fitting and best quality, they include unique features like our polis cover lift system and ratchet attachment system, making them the easiest and fastest covers to install and remove. Visit DalcoMarine.com for more information on how to order. Use promo code LARRY10 to receive a 10% discount today. Burger Smokehouse, your handcrafted smoked meat headquarters since 1952. Our dry rub recipes, aging process, and natural hardwood smoking come together to create bold, satisfying flavors that we are proud to stand behind. Whether it's summer sausage, hearty sportsman's cut bacon, or dry rub barbecue ribs, we are your source for top-notch hardwood smoked meats that you'll be proud to serve family and friends. Visit us online at smokehouse.com or look us up at your local grocery store. you what our first day up in Ontario we're up here at Wilderness North and what an awesome fishery I don't know what I got on here but this thing is absolutely huge we're doing a little trolling and boy I tell you what just tore into this thing and it's absolutely got my rod fit right over holy man Woo! this is a big fish Ryan, you're a slut. Yeah. Guy. Oh, oh wow. look yeah, look baby. At the rail go. <laughs> oh. Wait, you want to shut that motor off? <laughs> no. I probably should. Take, huh? take it easy, because there's only a walleye snap on there. Oh, don't tell me that now. <laughs> don't reef on him. Let him do whatever he wants. It's a big fish. Yeah, let him do whatever he wants, Larry. <laughs> Holy man, this is something. Wow, I might have to put the camera down. Yeah. This is a big fish. I did not think this fish was that big at first, but now. <laughs> Let's get a look at him. Let's get a look at him. He's made about 10 runs on me. Oh yeah. Oh my god. Oh, oh my god. What is that? Oh my god. Just look at the size of that pike. Bring him Can in. Get here. him in the net? Bring him in here. Get him. 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 Oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah. Woo! Yeah, baby. Oh my goodness. Yeah. <laughs> that is absolutely a giant. We just flew in here about two hours ago. And I'll tell you, Brian, you're the one that pulled out the trolling gear. This thing is absolutely a giant. Wilderness North has some very exclusive outposts, and I'll tell you, the fishing is absolutely tremendous. We've caught a bunch of walleye so far, but this pike, look at this pike, you guys. Oh, 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 I gotta leave her in the water. She's gonna break the net. Oh, holy moly! Wow. This is absolutely a giant pike. I'll tell you that. Wilderness North, when you're looking to come to Canada and you want to be treated well, run good equipment, and catch giant fish, look at the size of this pike. This thing's got to be 20 some pounds. 
Woo! Absolutely a monster. I'm gonna measure it first. How long is this thing? Oh, 40. Well, 46 inches. 46 inch pike. Look at the size of that pike. That is absolutely awesome. Nice. Let's get her back in the water. I did not think that fish was that big at first. <laughs> oh. Yeah. I just want to make beautiful. sure she's nice and lively before I let her go. Oh, beautiful, beautiful fish. Come on. Shell go. Shell go. There she is. Come on. Woohoo! Brian, I'll tell you what, we need to get back, but I'll tell you this is, oh, there, look at this one. That's a little nice, that's a nice wally. It's a nice fish. Yep. Oh, yeah. Whoa, look at how gold this fish is. Look how dark that fish is. I know it's, the light is getting bad. Look at how dark that fish is. That is absolutely, that is an awesome, awesome looking wally. That's what's amazing about coming up to Canada too, is that you do these fish have so many different colors in them because of this water. Boy, that's a beautiful fish. And look at that rip and wrap, absolutely gone. Hey Brian, one more cast, we better one get out of here. Badger Sportsman Magazine is the longest running outdoor magazine in the state of Wisconsin. Badger Sportsman provides you with the best information from local Wisconsin guides and professionals so you can be successful in the outdoors. Whether you're in a boat or a tree stand, Badger Sportsman Magazine is the new go-to for information on duck hunting, deer hunting, hard and soft water fishing, and more. Enjoy our product reviews, quick tips, and all of our articles on our website today. I'm Mark Green. I'm Patrick Lynch. Welcome to our all new Lynch McQuanago dealership. The brand new Lynch McQuanago dealerships have over 500 new Chevys, Chryslers, Dodges, Jeeps, Rams, and pre owned vehicles in stock and all priced to sell. Stop by and check out their massive selection of trucks and SUVs, perfect for all your fall outdoor sports. You do the driving, we'll do the listening, because I want you to love how you feel in your new ride. Nobody sells for less than Lynch. Wings Over Wisconsin, a nonprofit organization dedicated to natural resource restoration, preservation, and education with youth and community involvement. Through cooperation with private landowners, state and federal agencies, Wings Over Wisconsin has been a leader in the preservation of our natural wildlife habitat with donated dollars staying in Wisconsin for Wisconsin. For information about how you can join this great organization or how to start a new chapter, please visit wingsoverwisconsin.org. This is reminding me of last night. When that pike came up last night, Brian, I about came on glued. That was my biggest pike in my life right there, up here at Wilderness North Lodge. And hopefully this will be your biggest pike. Yeah, let's see what happens here. My personal best is 40. 40 inches? 40 inches. Okay, and that's a 40 inch pike is a huge pike. You know, this is the, oh, boy, oh boy. <laughs> <laughs> You know, you gotta love it. You know, it's one thing about Canada, it's amazing how you sleep at night. It kind of cleanses you, you know? Fresh air, good food. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. I'd like to get a look at this. Well, I know, that's how I was, oh. too. It's like, that's the hard part. You're Come like... On, baby. Don't want to horse it. No, you don't want to horse it. Oh, 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 oh yes. Oh, yeah. Nice heavy fish. Big fish. Oh, that, they are oh, really girthy here. I'm shaking already and it's not even, it. not even my fish. Come on, nice and smooth. 
I don't think it's 40, but it's pretty nice. I'm gonna say it's up to 30. Yeah, oh yeah. Ooh. Got him! Got him. All take, right. take. All right. <laughs> I'll let you take the nut so I can keep filming. Uh, hey, you know, the last two trips, I've been the camera guy, and I'm kind of enjoying this. Uh, Dan, uh, Dan's gonna have some competition coming up down the road there, Dan and Hunter, because uh, I'm gonna be doing a lot more filming of our show, Larry Smith Outdoors. Kind of enjoying this filming part. Not as good as the other guys by far. So there's lots of room for improvement. Okay. Let me get that tank in. Nice fish. Beautiful, beautiful Canadian northern here. That is a lot of fish. Good fight. Nice it is, huh? That's, you know that water's kind of like a root beer color. That looks like a nice fish, legend. Holy cats. That might be one of the nicest ones of the day. Too bad we don't have a bump board because right now I'm leading it at 21 and a half inches. Take a look at the color on that. I'm gonna zoom in on this fish. Look at the coloring on that fish. Absolutely unbelievable, beautiful coloring on that walleye. And we'll give her a good home again. I like that. Good home is her nice. She says, I'm out of here. She'll make her. There she goes. The deeper water. Yeah, gone. Shotgun shape for Midwest Shooter Supply. I got the ice junk. I got Erica Graham, Emily Lucas, big followers of mine on TV, Facebook. What? Everywhere. Everywhere, she says. You heard it, guys? Everywhere. <laughs> what we're doing today, bluegills. I just caught them. We're going old school. I left the skin on, pulled the fins off. We're going to dredge, dredge, put them in Larry's seasoning. We're going to go down with them. Everybody's going to have them, all right? We have Thai, we have uh, Italian, and what was the other one? Spicy something? Cajun, Cajun. All right, let's dredge. What flavor you want, Lair? What do we have? Uh, Italian, Cajun, like Thai. I don't like Thai. What a... <laughs> can we cut them out of the whole gag? Okay, man, can we cut them? What else you got? Italian! <laughs> I don't like Italian. You got anything else? Okay. Plate it up, guys. What do you want? Cajun. Oh, no, this is Italian. What do you want? Larry's got Cajun. I got Cajun? Yeah. No, I don't like Cajun. No, I don't like I like anything that All right, guys, this is Larry's new season. We have Thai, Cajun, and Italian. Skin on bluegill. Eat with our fingers? Yes, heck yeah. Break it right off. See how it falls right off the bone? You just take your finger right along the line, and it falls right off. Once again, thanks, Larry, for uh, letting us use the fish out of your pond. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> People, if you haven't used it this way, it doesn't take much. Take your knife, cut along the back, take the dorsal fins out, take the skin out, the guts out of it. That's what it looks like inside.
You don't like Cajun? Larry Smith Outdoors, Midwest Sewer Supply. We got the Ice Junkies. Oh, I forgot this. In case you guys don't win a big contest, here's some Lodge stuff. Your bacon press, your bacon press, and you can make some huge bluegills that you catch Emily in that pan. <laughs> so when you hold the fish up and just say, look at guys how big it is, you can put it in that pan. See, look at, shotguns fish don't fit in that pan. Look at, not a chance. You didn't catch them. Yeah, I did. Seriously, I caught them. Science. What do you say, girls? Thank you so much. Thank no problem. You. Cut it. For over 25 years, Midwestern Shooter Supply has been your premier dealer for hunting supplies. Our staff is friendly, experienced, and certified with over 15 years in gunsmithing experience. We're your one-stop shop for your hunting needs. Our inventory is at the lowest possible price, and we will match any other dealer advertised price. Do you do more than hunt? Check out our supply of fishing products as well. Visit Midwestern Shooter Supply today, or shop our web store at mwshooters.com. Midwestern Shooter Supply, we want to be your outdoor supplier. Introducing the next generation of Sonar. Sonar Phone by Vexlar, the world's first smart device sonar. Download the free app. Try the demo feature and see why Sonar Phone will rival the performance of Sonar systems costing hundreds more. The Sonar Phone does not require cell phone coverage. You create your own Wi-Fi hotspot and can share with your friends. Download the free app today. And for a limited time, with any purchase of a Sonar Phone, you get a free smartphone armband. That's the Sonar Phone by Vexlar. I'll tell you what, no doubt a top notch. Your seats are dry, you got fresh fish rags in the boat, the locator's dry. Yeah, good coffee, great breakfast. Got to catch some fish. Lance, another walleye? Just another walleye. Oops. It's a little early for shore lunch. Yeah, it is. I'm looking forward to that shore lunch today because we haven't done that yet. That'd be a good one for shore lunch, though. What's with you? No, there is no bad lunch. It was another walleye. Holy cats! Wow, cannibal! Let's see that. <laughs> we better we better take him out out of the out of the group, Lance. Right. Hey Lance, you know when you're in the right spot is when all you can hear is the wind whistling through your rods. Then you know you're in a little bit of heaven. Ah That was on artificial again? Oh, a little bit of a battle there. You know, this is this is a one heck of an experience, I'll tell you. Nice fish. Yes. Gotta love it. Nice job. I'm getting awful hungry. You got, did you guys get, you, I hope you guys came back from the grocery store with something good. Time for a little lunch, Larry. 
Lance, I'll tell you what, if I had to go to a grocery store, I don't think I could have picked out anything better. Perfect eaters. Right there, that's awesome. Took all about 15 minutes to get these, Larry. <laughs> that's one thing about fishing up here at Wilderness North, Lance, I'll tell you what, there's plenty of fish to be caught. That there is. Yeah, there's no doubt about that. Hey, Lanky, we got enough fish to, for lunch. It's almost ready. I don't know. When you eat, I don't know that we have enough fish. <laughs> it just never ends. Fish after fish. Hey, I'll tell you what. Wilderness North, Ontario, Canada, is the place that you want to check out for sure. This is one of them trips that I'll never forget. And this is why. Look at the scenic value, the quality of the fishing here. It's absolutely a paradise. Hey, I'll tell you what, Lance. Yep. Bro, we had just absolutely an awesome time here up at Wilderness North. Lance, what do you have to say about this whole experience? It was a great time there, Larry. It was nonstop walleye action. We've seen some of the biggest northern that we've seen and I've ever seen personally. And, yep. And the hospitality and the settings for us were just fabulous. You know, and speaking about the pike, that 46 and a half incher, that yep. was the biggest pike I've ever caught in my life. So that was that was a, a, an extra bonus for sure. And you know, just coming up here and experiencing all the things we got to experience, but you know, one of my favorite things is when we go on these trips are the people that we meet and the relationships that we make with people. What a positive thing. And you know, you can't replace that with anything. So Lance, Deborah, thank you very much in Wilderness You're North. Welcome. We also want to thank our friends over at Badger Sportsman yes. for inviting us up here for this great experience. And like I always say, you know what? What a great day to be alive. A little tough pushing that boat back there. Maybe he shouldn't have ate so many fish. What are you saying, Smith? Yeah, I said maybe you'll be lucky enough to finally find a girlfriend. Oh yeah, that'd be, you might be luckier trying to get a 62 inch northern. Hey, Smith. What? At least we have transportation. What are you talking about? I got a boat. Nice tie up job. What? How the hell did that happen? Come on now! We got fish to catch! I got a show to film! Hey! Hey, I was only kidding about your girlfriend! You finding a girlfriend! Hey! Come on!